Do it yourself. Simple skills, big results. How do you troubleshoot a Schumacher battery charger? If your Schumacher battery charger isn't working as it should, there are several steps you can take to figure out what's going wrong and how to fix it. Let's start by checking the basics. First, make sure the charger is properly connected to both the power source and the battery. If the connections are reversed, you'll see a red LED flashing, indicating that the clamps are reversed or the battery might be bad. This is a critical safety issue, so ensure the positive and negative clamps are correctly attached to the battery terminals. Next, check the error codes on the charger's display. These codes can give you a lot of information about what's wrong. For example, if you see an F01 error, it means the battery voltage is still too low after two hours of charging, which could indicate a bad battery. If you see an F04 error, it means the connections to the battery are reversed. If the charger is not producing any output voltage, even though the fan is working, there might be an issue with the internal circuitry. Check for any signs of physical damage or overheating. Sometimes the problem can be as simple as a bad circuit breaker. These breakers are designed to protect the charger from overheating and can be replaced if they are faulty. You can test the circuit breaker by measuring the voltage across it and checking for any resistance issues. Another common issue is the charger detecting a sulfated battery. If this happens, the charger will go into desulfation mode. If desulfation fails after 10 hours, the charger will abort and show an F02 error code. In this case, the battery might need to be checked or replaced. Ensure that the charger is not blocked by any obstructions and that it has proper ventilation. If the charger's internal temperature exceeds its limit, it will shut off to prevent damage. Move the charger to a cooler location and make sure its ventilation holes are not blocked. If the battery voltage drops too low during the maintain mode, it could be due to a drain on the battery or the battery itself being bad. Remove any loads on the battery and check if the issue persists. If it does, the battery might need to be replaced. Finally, if none of these steps resolve the issue, it might be time to contact Schumacher's customer service for further assistance or to inquire about warranty options if your charger is still under warranty. By following these steps, you should be able to identify and possibly fix the problem with your Schumacher battery charger. Remember to always refer to your product manual for specific instructions and guidelines related to your particular model.